Huntley, I, I had this this dream that I had a television show on on Me TV. What uh, what was it called? The Bob Bob Newhart show. You know you're a wonderfully creative person, but have you ever thought about getting out of show business? Watch me on Me Me TV. You'd watch me, right? Well, I, I, I'd watch you. Of course, I don't know how indicative I am of the, the viewing public. Tonight at 9, 8 Central on Me TV. Meow. Fish. Are you okay? Yeah, I just thought I heard something. What? A woman's voice. Oh, and what are our voices saying? Cadota figs and cottage cheese. <laughs> Cadota figs. Wait. She's thinking about a table in a restaurant. What is she thinking about the table? Handsome. The table is handsome. <laughs> what am I doing? I must be cracking up. But I do hear a girl's voice. Maybe it's ESP. I don't believe in that stuff. Don't be so quick to judge. I once read somewhere that anybody can have ESP. It just depends upon the right conditions. Where you are, how you feel, what you eat. Maybe it's the fillet of soul and string beans that set you off. <laughs> this is amazing. What is she thinking? She's thinking about the guy again. Sitting under the stuffed fish. There are two old ladies sitting under the stuffed fish. And so are we. She's thinking... She's thinking about me. She'd like to meet me. She'd like to caress my weather-beaten brow, stroke my manly chin. I think I saw her. She's looking this way. Take off my glasses and... You don't wear glasses. Oh. Wait. She's not thinking about me, Shelly. She's thinking about you. No. Come on. <laughs> she just smiled at me. You see, I'm telling you, I can tell what she thinks. It can't be. I'll tell you what. Take another bite of fish, then tell me her name. Alden. Something about Alden. She doesn't look like an Alden. How was your lunch? Oh, terrific. Mm. Say, you wouldn't happen to know the name of that girl sitting over there. Lana something or other. She works over across the street at Alden's Furniture Store. Alden's Furniture? That's the Alden you heard. Will there be anything else for you? Yes. What is she eating? <laughs> Curious, ain't you? Cadota figs and cottage cheese. Cadota figs? I told you. There's a guy around the corner who ordered broccoli. Isn't that exciting? <laughs> oh, you can read her mind. Her food, her job. What else did she think about me? Look, why don't you go over there and talk to her? Oh, no, I couldn't. With what she's thinking about you, you can't miss. What'll I say? Tell her you're an accountant and you'd like to add up her check. I am not going over there. Oh, you've got to. She's dying to meet you. Then why doesn't she come over here? Forget it. Let's go. No. I'll go. Good. Now there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> She's thinking on my way over. She was excited. Was excited. She isn't any more because she saw me chicken out. No, she's more excited now because you teased her. Now go on.
<laughs> Shelly, what are you doing? I'm teasing her. <laughs> Are you enjoying your Cadota figs? Well, how did you know? I, uh, I saw the waitress bring them over. Uh, would you mind if I sat down and had a cup of coffee? Oh, sure. <laughs> Surprise! Surprise? You called me 15 minutes ago and begged me to come over here and help you. I know, but I'm surprised you came. Yeah, well, so am I. This is ridiculous. No, it is not. I need you to tell me what she's thinking so I don't blow it. You're not gonna blow it. You'll do just fine. No, I won't. I'll blow it. I know me. I grew up with me. Look, I told you all the things she was thinking about you, right? Right. Okay, now all you have to do is what comes naturally. Uh, unfortunately, what comes naturally is cringing and whimpering. You've <laughs> got to help me. Here, I made some filet of sole and string beans. Now, all you have to do is eat this, what? sit in the closet, and if I run into trouble, I'll ask you what she's thinking. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> she's here, please. <sighs> Eat your fish, and don't forget the greens. <laughs> Lana, how nice of you to come. Won't you come in? I'd love to, if you wouldn't mind taking the chain off the door. <laughs> Hi, Shelly. Hi. May I take your wrap? Mm -hmm. Have a seat. Uh, I'll be right with you. Are you getting your powers? I'm getting sick. Have you ever shared a closet with a deep-fried fish? What's she thinking? She's excited to see you? And, and what? And she's wondering why the apartment smells like fish. Shelly? Do I smell fish? Keep eating. <laughs> yes! You noticed. You're, um... You're smelling my salmon-scented air spray. I have this thing about the sea. Oh. Well, I've never heard of salmon-scented air spray. Yes, well, I picked it up at this groovy little shop on 41st Street. They also had... Rhubarb, baked potato, <laughs> and essence of rack of lamb. It's really nice being around a man with a sense of humor. It's nice being around a woman with a sense of a sense of humor. <laughs> Did that make sense? Uh -huh. <laughs> Would you care for a drink? Sure. Uh, apricot wine with a twist of lemon? Mmm, fine. 71 was a very good year for apricots. <laughs> Not a bad year for lemons, either. Um, here, let me show you something. This is the way the French drink. It's sort of a civilized form of Indian wrestling. <laughs> Lana? Yes? I'd really like to show you my skis. They're handmade, and I really want you to see them. <laughs> what am I doing? You were doing fine until you brought up the skis. I couldn't help it. I had to talk to you. Does she still like me? Like you? She's wild about you. She thinks you're funny and nice and sexy. Sexy? She's a sick girl. <laughs> What's she thinking? I can't tell you, but I'd love to do it. I better get back out there. Keep eating. <laughs> These are them. Oh, they're very nice. I thought you'd like them. Now, where were we? Right 
there. Down the hatch. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean it. Quick, get me a towel. Oh, oh Patterns, want or a plain one? <laughs> Anything, just hurry. Here, let me wipe it up. I think you'd better do it. You're mad, aren't you? No, I'm not mad. Good. Then I'll show you my guitar. <laughs> I blew it, didn't I? No. She's crazy about you. But you're gonna blow it if you play the guitar. I don't want to play it. I just want to show it to her. Oh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and then, when you turn it inside out, there's a picture of a tiger climbing Mount Fuji. Oh, nice. Uh, Shelly. Wouldn't you like to dance or something? Dance, sure. You would? Yes. But first, I'd like to show you my collection of bubblegum baseball cards. Shelly, I've seen enough. I've seen your Mount Fuji jacket, your CPA exam, your first pair of baby boots. But it's really a major collection. I've got three Bo Belinskis and a satchel page. <laughs> Want a string bean? No. Do you want to dance close? Shelly, she's beginning to think something's wrong with you. She is? Look, forget the dancing. Just kiss her already. She wants to kiss me? She's past kissing. She's past marriage. She's wondering what you're going to do with the kids in case of a divorce. <laughs> You don't have to eat string beans to know what that meant.